4,000. More vaccines are headed to Utah next week, and that may have many seeing the light at the end of the COVID tunnel. Mike Hedrick is live with us tonight, and Mike officials saying it's not quite time yet to let down our guard. Yeah, Dave, as you guys just talked about there, the data has been more and more positive this week when we talk about the number of COVID cases and the number of people who have been vaccinated. But if that remains, is there an end in sight? And if so, when is it? We are projecting hope to people that there is an end to this and uh, both, both individually and collectively. After nearly a year of wearing masks and social distancing, Governor Cox says he is more optimistic than ever normalcy will return. Next week, the state will average 40,000 weekly doses of the vaccine. In the next two months, additional companies providing vaccines will bump those doses to more than 100,000 a week. He says the narrative claiming the vaccine isn't really changing anything is premature and simply not true. And not only is it wrong medically, but it, it, it's wrong and, and discourages people from getting the vaccine. This idea that well, if I get the vaccine and nothing changes, then, then what, what are we doing? Because we're less than a year into it, scientists are still learning just how much the vaccines reduce transmission of the virus. But evidence shows their effectiveness against the disease is extremely high. Even though it's so tempting to want to say this is when the end of the pandemic will be or this is when we don't have to wear masks, it's really, really, really tough to predict that accurately. And Dr. Dunn isn't about to make a prediction. What she will tell you is wear a mask, social distance, the vaccine is effective, and be patient. Once we get 80% or so of our population vaccinated and we're just seeing sporadic cases of COVID, that is when we as public health will consider it over. Now, I apologize. I know all of you are probably expecting an exact date for when we're going to reach that herd immunity and be able to go back to normalcy. Not the cases you see there. Science experts do believe, though, we could reach herd immunity by summer, maybe fall at the latest. But again, it depends on a number of factors. Those who are willing to get vaccinated and just how quickly people can get vaccinated. Back right, to you. Right. By the fact that there is no date means patience is going to be the order for